This particular diving mask can be purchased on Amazon and they have their own Amazon storefront under the name Platinum Arowana. Ooh. I am so happy that it's sunny outside. There's been so many crazy storms keeping me from doing water content. The last thing though I do want to mention is whenever you are trying new goggles, there's always a little bit of a learning curve. I don't expect this first time in the water to be perfect. You shouldn't either. Like it is best if before you go on vacation, if you can spend time practicing with a snorkel because oftentimes the snorkel is really good. You just, you need to learn it. I don't know if you can hear me. <laughs> There's supposed to be anti-fog. They all say that though, okay? I know I'm breathing out of my mouth and my nose and alternating. And I think I'm doing a pretty good job of not fogging this up. <laughs> you get a really big head when you wear these. It's all manual inflation. You have a cute little straw and you can blow it up to have a little bit of air, a lot of air, whatever your preference is. Oh my God, this is amazing. Oh my God. No water is getting in. The view is definitely panoramic. There's not much going on in my pool, but I do have the pool cleaner going, you know, cause like you gotta look at something. <laughs> and I'll tell you, it is something underwater. I love how it has separate chambers for your eyes and like your nose and mouth, just because it truly does make this anti-fog. Other goggles alone, like there are different breathing tactics you can do to keep them from fogging. But like at the end of the day, they do. And then they try to sell you anti-fog cleaning solution that's always sold separately. No, like I don't want to do that. Like, that their goggles are expensive. I want to attach this. To me, this alone is so good. It's hard to think that this is going to enhance some things, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> when I was leaning back, when I inhale through my nose, I was like, Whoa, it's so sweet, dude. And then it's like, Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> I'm not entirely convinced that this little extension piece is worth it. I go under the water and I no longer can breathe. <laughs> There's just no oxygen. And it's just suctioning my face. What? <laughs> like. It's okay if this limits me from doing my flips and my corkscrews, like that's fine. But sometimes it really is just hard to inhale. Guys, listen, I have been using my mask so much. I feel like I'm getting a little bit dependent on it. I saw it coming, okay? Like I have always been a goggle girl. I've done competitive swimming. So nothing is like suckier to me than having to be goggleless and not have it miserably tight around my eye sockets. It's just been amazing. And apparently you can attach a GoPro to the snorkel. Once it's on, you can slide it up a little bit more. You have to get a tool to unscrew the little bolt inside. So here's the front with the grooves. And because of these grooves, you can only slide this on one way. And then I recommend actually leaning it backwards so you can grab this all on one hand. And then next we have to screw in the bolt. Now, if you look though, these grooves are not symmetrical because you actually have something jutting out on one side. Hold it perfect to make sure you are going through every single hole. It's a little tricky one-handed, but I wanna show that it can be done in case you were on vacation watching this in the ocean sand, in the bright sun. Oh my gosh, I feel sorry for you. <laughs> Popping the main bolt in this way actually will expose more threads to catch on to the little baby bolt. But let's take a look at that when this is on top here. So here is your snorkel in relation to the direction of your GoPro. So like I said, I have tropical fish we're in my pool but what I do have for you is my robot vacuum right here so we're going to follow my robot vacuum around If you 
want your snorkel mask to last longer, you are gonna have to keep up with some aftercare. Most of everything is plastic and easy to deal with, but just be mindful of the bolt because it is metal here. And so if it's sitting in water, it will eventually rust. In the little baggie though, be careful because there are these small replacement parts inside. I'm not for sure if the vendor ever gives out additional replacement parts. The last thing I want to emphasize is that this mask is one whole unit. Clean it as is, store it as is. There's no need to rip it apart. <clears throat> I just want to be a little more specific on the product name of this. <laughs> this is the Platinum Arowana Professional Full Face Snorkel Mask Snorkeling Gear for adults and kids. 180 degrees panoramic view, adjustable anti-fog, anti-leak, dry system, set. Diving mask with detachable camera mount. I hope I enunciated all of those delicious keywords to the YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more, and I love you. I mean it. Bye, guys.